Sneakers app. I did get a W though, let's go! Yo, what's going on with your YouTube jumping Chris here? We're coming back at y'all with another video, guys. Hey, so a lot's going on this week, guys. A lot is going on this week and the next few weeks because it felt like it's been kind of slow lately. You know, we got Kobe Day tomorrow. Kobe's birthday is today. Happy B Day to Kobe. You know, I can always admit that, you know what? Before his passing, I wasn't always a huge Kobe fan. I did respect the man. Just the reason why, because look, I grew up as a Michael Jordan fan. That was my icon. That was my hero. And then, you know, when Kobe came in, it was more like LeBron and all that. A lot of people were trying to say that Kobe was better than Jordan. And I was like, nah, MJ's still my guy. Just like now, they're trying to, you know, people are trying to say LeBron's the GOAT. And then you got your Curries. It just, every generation just moves and moves on. But you know, my generation will always, will be Michael Jordan. But that being said, I did, I was actually more of a fan towards the end of Kobe's uh, career because I respect his game. Like I saw how, you know, he was playing really hard, especially when he didn't have a team and he was playing like crazy minutes and, you know, got himself injured. But hey man, happy Kobe day, man. So uh, yeah, man, we gotta talk about some releases today because we got, like I said, a lot's gonna happen this week. A lot. Just start, we'll start off real quick about the Kobe 8s, the halos, the all white joints. So on sneakers app, there was probably about over 80,000 pairs, which it seems to be a decent amount of stock. I think that's more than the GGs. That's definitely more than the Mamacitas. I can't remember because the Grinches came out three years ago, the Retros or the Pro Tros, I should say. I forgot how many pairs were these, but I feel like these things were pretty low as well. So the Halos that came out, it's a decent amount of stock, but I'm, you know, it seemed like a lot more people took all a lot more L's. And I was actually also happy about that. I saw that there was like, they had preschool sizes and GS sizes because that's what Vanessa Bryant wanted. He wanted the Kobe shoes to go more to, you know, to the kids and stuff. So kids can be able to play in Kobe's as well, which I think was really dope. And Nike had a draw for a 20 minute draw today on the sneakers app, Remembrance of Kobe Bryant. Hey, we just had a sneaker pass yesterday for the Halo. So maybe that helped out a little bit. But again, a hey, sneakers app, it's always tough to get on it, no matter what. You got over millions of people on the sneakers app every morning trying to cop shoes. And it just always happens that we're going, someone's going to take some L's, someone's going to take some W's. It just is what it is. I'm happy I was able to get a W in my local area, so can't wait to do that unboxing. About some news also, some shock drop news just happened on the sneakers live, only in the UK or EU. So it was the frozen moments, the Air Jordan 4, the women's shoes. They did drop them on during the sneakers live, I believe. The people in the US, you know, if you had that, um, if you had a US account, you were going to be able to get them. But they're coming out this weekend. So if you guys really want those things, it sh might be a little bit of a problem just because it's the women's shoes. Because, you know, the bigger size is going to be a little bit more inflated. You know how that, you know how that goes. The bigger the sizes is, the, lot, the less the pairs I have because it is a women's school. All right, guys, so let's talk about some Kobe Day restock. That's right, hey, to celebrate Kobe, 824, August 24th, we're gonna get some restocks of some Kobe, some good Kobe's, some iconic Kobe's. Definitely, I know a lot of people took some L's and are looking forward to get some pairs. I mean, this is probably, uh, arguably, a lot of people are saying these are the best Kobe's of all time. I could agree. I work in my, I work out of mine all the time, man. I work. I actually wear my Kobe's a lot. I actually uh, go to the gym in my Bruce Lee Kobe's every day. No cap. It's just I know a lot of people are excited for it, but I just want to just let you, guys, let you guys know. I know, but the whole, you know, what Kobe and Vanessa Bryant they had a contract. We we're supposed to get more pairs. It's gonna be make it more fair, more available. I'm just saying for this Kobe day, don't get your hopes up. That's all I'm saying. Don't get your hopes up thinking there's gonna be over 100,000 pairs of them. We're all gonna eat, we're all, no. It's not gonna happen, man. Until I see it, until I actually see that we're gonna get some more Kobe's out there, then I'll believe it because it, the stock looks pretty freaking low, all right? So we are gonna get some Kobe's. The Grinches, which is, like I said, again, a fan favorite. Even the Mamacitas and the GGs that came out early, earlier this year. You know, hey, again, this is another great shoe. Um, some people like it, some people don't. You know, it is what it is. But, you know, I like them. I think these are, things are nice. You know, all white shoe. And we just got the Halos or, you know, the Halos just released. Another great one. But it being all white. The Mamacita is actually another great one too as well. So, but again, 
Don't get your hopes up guys because the stock is looking a little low. I got this all on Twitter and you know with these stock numbers you gotta take it with a grain of salt you know but I kind of believe it with it being happening you know again restart or Kobe day August 28th the mamacitas right the sweet 16s these joints it's less than it's about 5,900 pairs less than 6,000 pairs the most stock I see is a size 9 or actually a size 11 which is close to a thousand pairs but like the smaller size is barely any you know size 9 eight and a half or like less than like 400 500 um, again very very low on stock you know you, you think 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 like this like a hundred thousand people is going to be on the stinkers app trying to get these things you know a lot of these shoes are worth bread so people are definitely everybody's gonna go after them and remember these just came out guys again it was pretty limited pretty tough to get so it's low in the back end stock numbers are looking very low like less than two thousand pairs all right uh again the biggest size, the most size is a size 11, which is about 200 pairs. Uh, everything else is less than 100. Size 8 is about 120. Again, take these numbers as you, as you, you know, as you want. Not sure if it's like complete 100% true. Now, the big one, I think a lot of people are really looking forward to, are the Grinches. I know we're gonna get the reverse Grinches, the all red joints coming out in uh, in the holiday season. So just you know, be prepared for that one. That should be a good one. Hopefully, we get enough pairs. But again, it being a Kobe, I don't know. Again, this one's less than a thousand pairs. Less than a thousand freaking pairs, y'all. Like, it's just not enough. Like, you know, I know a lot of people are hyping this up. Like, hey, we're gonna restock up some hype Kobe's. But again, there's not enough pairs. Like, there's not a lot of pairs out there. So I just don't want you guys to get your hopes up thinking there's going to be so many pairs. Obviously, a lot of people are going to take L's and we're probably going to get upset about it and get on social media and all this stuff. But for the stock being this low, I'm expecting it to be like a sneakers pass. Probably it's most likely going to be like a uh, exclusive access or something like that. You know, if you took all L's from all the Kobe's, you know, if you or something, whatever the, quite, the correct criteria is going to be. Or will it be a sneakers pass only in LA? Because they just did that for the Halos. It was only in LA and New York. I was literally just in New York. So, <laughs> but I'm just saying, like, uh, it's pro that's probably how it's gonna happen. Guys, just, I don't want you guys to get your hopes up. So, but hey, this is pretty cool that we should be getting some Kobe's, man. Congrats to anyone that do end up getting W's, but I don't want everyone to get their hopes up, man. Just don't get your hopes up. That's all I'll say, all right? And uh, we're supposed to get some other more Kobe's too. I was, uh, I'm thinking, we're, I heard that we're also gonna get the. The Hall of Fame joints, those are gonna be good. Uh, you know, that's the one I did have, but I let them go. It just, it's a little too much gold. But you know, again, I, I wouldn't mind a hat keeping the collection, just to have in the collection. It's a, a shoe I probably wouldn't wear. But the one Kobe that I really, 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 really want, and I hope it comes out to the public one day, eventually, you know, especially with this whole Kobe, you know, like wasn't all the Kobe supposed to be, you know, reintroducing and relaunching again, right? I mean, we're supposed to get some more Kobe's down the road, and I'm hoping we're supposed to get some more stock too. I really want the fade to black, y'all. The fade to black Kobe's. It was the last shoe that Kobe wore on his last game. That was uh, that was amazing. I thought with the Kobe ID uh, at that time, I thought that we were gonna get those, but that was another exclusive access, very hard to get. And I should have pulled the trigger, uh, you know, of course before his passing, because I really want them. You can watch my old SneakerCon videos. I seen them, but they're like always expensive. They're always like five, six hundred, eight hundred. Now they're like two bands, of you know, with of course because it's passing. But that was a shoe I wish I would have just pulled the trigger on. But hey, it is what it is, man. Anyway, guys, you guys comment down below, man. You guys let me know how'd you guys do on those Kobe Halos, man. Did you guys end up get a, end up getting a W? You guys took an L. Did not go for them. You're not feeling them. If anyone has a size nine and a half or a ten, please hit me up. I'm looking for a pair. All right. Anyway, guys, I just want to say, hey, I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. If you guys don't mind, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if it's your first time here. Comment down below and please hit that bell for all the notifications when I do drop vids and. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media at Chris and IG, sometimes on Twitter, and don't forget Snapchat. I'm also on TikTok. Hey guys, appreciate y'all. Love y'all. I'm Jeremy Chris. Peace.